Good day today. I Sankit Sudhir Kurkuri of Class 6 the DKVAC Center would, would wish you a very happy 74th Independence Day. Today I am going to tell you about two brave unsung freedom fighters without who played a very crucial role in the freedom struggle. Rani Velunaj. Rani Velunaj was born in 1730. She was the only child of King Ramanathapura. She uh, she was the queen of Shivaganga. She married uh, Muthu Thevar. In 1772, the Britishers attacked Shivaganga and Thevar was martyred. Rani Velu fled to the forest of Dindigalu. There she spent eight years. In her eight years time in Dindigalu forest, she she made an army of brave young uh, women and named it after Udiyal, who had saved Rani Velu's life. Uh, her, and an interesting fact about the war is that her commander Kuyuli along with a few other women entered the fort of Shivaganga disguised as rural women. Uh, they performed the Vijayadashami Puja. They waited for the right time and they attacked, they suddenly attacked the Britishers and succeeded in killing all the British guards and opened the gate for Queen Re Velu Nachir to enter the fort. Of Rani Velu Nachir entered the fort with lightning speed and attacked the Britishers. A fierce war ensured between them. Uh, when the war was going on, the brave commander Kuyuli noticed the, Brit the Britishers' ammunition depot. She poured herself ghee, which was in the temple, and set herself on fire. Then she jumped, she, she jumped into the ammunition depot. With a sudden explosion, the ammunition went into the flames. And the Rani Velu Nachar succeeded in getting back her kingdom from the Britishers. She was the first Indian queen to wage a war against the Britishers and won and won the war against them. She played uh, she it happened decades before the 1856 revolution. Shahid Kumudir Bose. Shahid Kumudir Bose was born in 1889 in the district in the village of Habbal of the district Midnapur district in West Bengal. He was a young revolution. He was a young revolutionary who joined with his headmaster Satyananda Basu. Uh, he was inspired by Arubindo Ghosh. At the young age of 14, he realized that uh, without the use of Swadeshi goods, uh, the, the Indian